Imagine that. Uh, all that olive oil deeply soaking into your skin. I mean, until you whew, smell like a Greek salad. Beads of sweat trickle down your naked, glistening body, baking you, oiling you, until you're ready to go down to the rock ledge overlooking the water. Crystal blue water. Okay, let's have some fun. Let's go for a swim. Suggests Rasta. Yeah, she's laughing. She's an energetic Rastafarian. And uh, so from the cave, the lovers wind down uh, through time and sage colored uh, uh, sage uh, landscape uh, to a secluded sea ledge overlooking Red Beach. Ooh. They gaze, uh, fish nibbling on seaweed, underling. Undulating to phantoms beneath the surface and enchanted this sunburst come up at you from the sandy bottom. Yeah, so marvelous. Oh, the cave dwellers stand amazed, earthy, mm -hmm. scratchy, and so oily. Uh, Rasta pauses in hippie meditation. How glorious it feels. What a marvel to be 14 years old and free. Good. Absolutely free from straight society. A lover of a gentle over 30. Uh, a smuggler. Hang out in the catacombs. World tribe. Fun-loving, hedonistic. Hashy smoking dropouts, blowing the war mongering world away. So she dives in, the dramatic dive, splash, psh, woo, come together. Cold water, body shock, sudden transformation of dimension, the buoyancy, salty uh, wetness, and we're weird, a sudden synthesis of your whole body. Instantly feeling organic. It's good to have all the limbs attached to the torso. Um, yeah. Clean. Fresh. In an instant. Dramatic splash, huh? Cave is gone. Along with the thirsty night from all the hash smoking. <laughs> Rough throat. Oh, smoky fire. <laughs> Ah, oh, Rasta Princess of Egypt swishes salt water <laughs> through her teeth, gargling the sea <laughs> while floating on her naked back. Mm -hmm. She fantasized. Oh, she's floating down the Nile. Oh, Cleopatra with all her courtiers fanning her. Mm -hmm. And she froth forth the foaming seawater crudely, suggestively <laughs> sexy from the corners of her lips. Well, Sphinx gazes down at his placeful Rastafarian. Her eyes closed now in total bliss. Sphinx wants to play with her breasts. Uh, but he does not plunge into the Aegean like Rasta. And he is nude, except for his military binoculars and turban. And uh, he's looking at Rasta. his phallic erection uh, points towards Egypt, Cairo specifically. And he focuses those binocs on, well, here come the flotilla of Greek fishing boats. Yeah, they've been fishing all night. They're coming back into harbor. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. and, oh, there it is. There it is. There's the white crystal world piece. Yeah, and it, it's sailing in discreetly. There's some islands uh, right offshore, tiny ones called the Paxamadia Islands in the boat anchors there waiting for the signal. Mm -hmm. 
And then he <laughs> splush. Where'd he go? Oh, uh, yeah, into the Aegean to play with his animal mate. I wish these tropical birds would quiet down a little bit. They're kind of getting on my nerves. I'm trying to record here. Um, well, the salt water, it thins down all that overdose olive oil overdose. Uh, over their deeply tanned bodies. It, 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 it tapers it down to a finer delicacy of olive oil. Not, th not thick and oily anymore. Oh, well, I get out of the water and they bask. They just, they just eye gaze. It's a Tantra thing. You just stare into the eyes of someone. I mean, you normally don't do this, especially silently because it sort of triggers off a like flight and fight Om Namah Shivaya. <laughs> I don't, I don't have sex anymore. I'm 74. It's too much maintenance, and <laughs> I, I've lost my instruction manual. I make love with my eyes. I need some eye makeup at this point. You know, my eyelashes really need some of that Afghani coal, K-O-H-L. I got to get some of that. I'll order that right now after this. I mean, I got Amazon Prime, and I'm just going to get it. And um, so it, hopefully by Chapter 3, <laughs> you know, I'll be looking like uh, Johnny Depp. <clears throat> Pirates of the Caribbean? Oh, the women love that. Look, oh, 